up it's day one of mercedes-benz fashion week australia i am taking you behind the scenes this week going to uh, have a chat to a few of my favorite bloggers and meet some designers and just basically show you what it is really like video diary with margaret Hi. what do you think of the show really beautiful I love what are you wearing today margaret i'm wearing Amazing. Yeah, Sets set, set the bar. Yeah. The I, I think her color got cool. She's very. It's, you know what? I loved the black and white. The black. Very minimalist. Yeah. Really? You like the black? I know. I was like, good, like, good like the black. Yeah. But I like the black. Thought. Well, I wanted to show you my outfit today. I have a little ear cuff on, a uh, little clutch bag that I got in Paris, and here is my dress. Tash Oakley and I in matching Cobot. I think Cobot is back. I'm is so back? into it. I'm so glad it's back. Let's check out your outfit. I'm loving this loving suit. Where's I've your got, outfit? I could, it's Bianca Spender. Ah, so I've just found the damsel in Dior, JC, all the way from Cali. Yes, I've come a long way. Welcome to Australia. It's your first Thank fashion you. week here in Australia, right? Yeah, it's my first fashion week in Sydney and my first time to Australia ever. Uh, ever. And I yes. love that you, you're just saying how much you love the humidity here. I do. Terrible. I kind of do. It's so good for girls' hair, right? Uh, <laughs> I'm not feeling the humidity, but okay. it's okay. Okay. Okay, but you okay, I'm back home. I survived day one of Mercedes Benz Fashion Week. It wasn't really a whole day, it was really just one show, but anyway, I made it. Back home now, and can you believe I met Paula Abdul? I kind of like fangirled out for a minute there. She's so sweet. I had like a little bit of my like bra showing, like not even that much, just like a tiny little bit. And before we had the photo, she was like, you should fix that. I'm like, oh my God, I love it. We just saw the Carla and Patty show. So beautiful, like really young and modern and funky. I think a lot of girls are going to go crazy for that this season. And it was styled, oh, the creative director was Michelle Jank. So there was some really cool styling. Make sure you check like, out like the hand stuff. They had really cool like leather hand wraps. And then also um, amazing headpieces. I think they were in conjunction with Hatmaker. So, because Hatmaker was a sponsor. Know, like um, clear visors like I wish that I was cool enough to roll around in one of them um, but yeah day one made it my makeup kind of held up okay I got super glossy in the end so I'm sorry about the like some of the last photos I'm like really shiny um, but I think my hair kind of got better because it was rainy and wet and it just sort of went okay and the peeps love the cobalt so that's always a winner oh and this is where I record my YouTube videos if you've ever wanted to see um, this is my sunroom which doubles as my wardrobe so this is only half of my wardrobe, but um, this is the light side and there's some dark jackets on the end there. And I'll show you the other half tomorrow. If there's anything that you want to see in these videos, please let me know because um, I'm going to be at Fashion Week uh, every day and I'll probably do maybe a morning video and maybe a nighttime video. I'll see how I go. So if you want to see anything in particular at Fashion Week or you want to have a chat to anyone, let me know and I'll have a chat to them for you. Okay, I love you. Bye. <laughs>